It is a dangerous job. The men and women who stand high above our city building its future. They are the iron workers and their motto is we don't just go to the office. We actually build it. Well, I went to their office recently to see what it takes to make the cut as an iron worker. Take a look. They shape our city's skyline, calling themselves cowboys in the sky. Uh, the rebel, you know, the, the daring guy that, you know, would be out on the ranch, you know, out roping cattle and, and riding cattle. And, you know, we, we apply that same type up in the air. These cowboys learn the ropes at Iron Workers Local 3. I put on the hard hat and slipped on the gloves and got a taste of their reality, which is knowing the dangers, but not letting them consume you. You know, if you don't have a little bit of fear in you, I think you're, you're never going to be safe. People would be surprised. They look up in the air and think, oh, these guys must be thinking about holding on. We're up there talking about everyday things, just like you at the office. But at their office, they are dressed to stay safe. Lanyard. We have to be tied off 100% all the time. Okay. So no matter what, you're hooked to something. Up. I was just 20 feet off the ground, but it was still a little unsettling. Okay, I'm not sure I want to do that. <laughs> but with some guidance, I helped them install the beam then climbed out to loosen the pulley. I just go ahead and take it out. Things soon got noisy. Not like a man has power tools. It's more than hammering and hanging out in high places. There's mathematical and analytical skills. And welding. And when the day's done, time to unwind. They're very competitive. And, the, and the, the thing with this is they see who can get up the fastest to ring the bell. If you can climb the beam, but I did grasp the iron worker's sense of pride. You know, every iron worker loves to, you know, drive by a building and say, hey, I was part of that building, I was part of that building. <laughs> wow. And by the way, all the exercises I went through are the same for those taking part in Local 3's apprentice program. Were you scared at all? I was a little scared. I mean, we were only a couple stories off the ground, but you're just on that beam. But luckily you're, you're wired in and you're kind of, you're roped in so you're okay. And I got this little souvenir, the bolt I installed on that beam, they gave it to me as a little souvenir. Did you ever make it up to ring the bell? Did you ever? What do you think? <laughs> by, by the way, here it is, the little nut. It's missing from a beam somewhere, so hopefully the beam doesn't <laughs> fall down. But, <laughs> Yikes. That, is, that is awesome. I'm, I had a great time. I'm impressed. Thank to Iron Workers Local 3 for all the, all the fun. Enjoyed it. All right, Andrew. <laughs> Yikes. Vice President Joe Biden will be in Pittsburgh on Monday.